Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Super Fanboy Guy again, and I'm bringing you a new video today. It's going to be another box opening video. And for all those who are watching this video on YouTube right now, I just want to say congratulations because this is the first time that I'm going to be opening a box of uh, DC Infinite Crisis. Yeah, so um, just to give you kind of a background, I didn't really play much of this set when it first came out. But I was recently able to find a box of it, uh, a sealed box of it, and I'm going to open it and try to hopefully pull some cool stuff. And I don't really know a whole lot. I know Shadow Pack is one of the archetypes. But um, yeah, my first box of Crisis that I've ever opened before. So I guess we'll go ahead and uh, get started here. So I'll just kind of cut off this. Oop, it's kind of loud, but all right. I know, I think Villains United is one of the other uh, archetypes in the deck. So I guess we'll just kind of put this right here. Alright, we kind of get this like little insert thing, which is kind of cool. Alright, let's go with our first pack, a flash pack. So I'm just going to kind of skim all the cards and put all the rares and foils aside. So, okay. Ooh, Dr. Fate foil. <laughs> Off to a foil rare. That's pretty cool. Not too shabby. Oh, I can smell that. That new card smell feels so awesome. Okay. We will do Lex Luthor next. Alright. Cloak of Naboo is cool. Alright, we got a foil Sasha Bordeaux, which I think they have her as a promo foil, so not really much there. Uh, Fatality, okay. Dead shot, pretty cool card. Jamie Reyes, Blue Beetle is our foil. And Knight's Gambit is our rare. Uh, Our Man 3, Our Man, that's our foil. And our rare is June Moon Enchantress, the 6 drop. I guess the 4 drop would be pretty cool to pull as well. So hopefully we get that one. Okay. Alright, we got another foil rare, the Rock of Eternity. It's a location card. That card is really good. Okay. All right, foil forbidden loyalties. And our rare is Alan Scott Sentinel. Right. I think we're about halfway to the left side. Okay. Another foil rare, Superboy. Oh, that's pretty cool. He's really good in the Shadow Pack deck. Right. The Helm of Naboo. Right. Foiled 
uh, Oblivion Bar. Ooh, Captain Marvel. Very cool. The Shadow Pack 8 drop. Pretty much pay. He has loyalty, pay 25 endurance. You win the game. Love those alternate win condition cards. So cool. Oops. Accidentally bumped my light, so my apologies. Okay. Oop, piece of the pack came off there. Okay. Oh my gosh, really? <laughs> Foil Captain Marvel? That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty funny, actually, after we just pulled a non foil one. <laughs> okay. So those. And we got three more packs on the left side. Zatanna, very cool. All right, foils stepping between worlds. Adam Xanadu, good for the Shadow Pack deck. Adam Strange is our rare. Foil Nightmaster and Pawn of the Black King. That's a rare. Okay. Foil T Spheres. And Sayabo's Garden. Probably saying that wrong. So that's our rare anyway. Saibos? I don't know. Alright, now on to the other side. The right side. Right side of the box, of course. Alright. There's that. Foil is Allied Against the Dark. And our rare is Black Adam. Right. About eight minutes on the video. Okay, cool. Okay. Foil transmutation. And our rare is... Oh, did I pass it already? Oh. Transmutation was the foil rare. I missed that. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> ah, Detective Chimp. One of the banned cards. And there's a reason why this card is banned. It's too good. Brother Eye as our foil. And our rare is... Alright! June Moon! Sweet! This is one of the cards we wanted, so we got one. That's pretty cool. Very cool. Okay. Foil... Uh, Hunter Zolom, Professor Zoom. That's oh, that's the rare. That's so usually if you get a foil rare, you get your foil on your rare in one card. So no more foils or rares for us. Ooh, epic battle. That's a good one to have. Helma Nibu is always good. Ooh, this one's pretty good too. All right, foil checkmate armory. And our rare is dodge the bullets. 
Ooh, Bizarro. <laughs> That's cool. All right. Let's go ahead and just uh, pull put the box aside. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs left. Okay. Ooh, Foil Sinestro. That's pretty cool. Pariah. That's our rare. Now there's non-foil Sinestro. Well, a non-foil to go with our foil one. That's what I meant to say. Okay. Store group. Uh, foil multiverse power battery. And the rare is JSA Headquarters. Okay, so good for the JSA deck. All right, next. A foil sand. Lex Luthor, Mockingbird. And Conjuration. Oh, this is this is a fun card. So play it only during the recruit set. You may pay 15 endurance if you do gain one resource point and spend this resource point only to recruit a character card with the printed Shadow Pack team affiliation. So pretty much you can play, um, gives you an extra resource point. So you can play a six drop, um, a six drop on turn five, a seven drop on turn six, or there's a Doctor Fate that costs eight that you can play on turn seven. So not bad, not bad. So four more packs left here. Alexander Luthor. Oh, that's cool. Foil Lex Luthor Mockingbird. It's uh, uncommon. Ultra Human Knight. Ooh. Secret Society Vengeance. He's an eight drop. Whenever Ultra Humanite becomes stunned, you may kill him. If you do, move target character to your front row. That is kind of interesting. Alright. Final three. Cheetah. A foil, foil a moment of crisis. All right, Rex Tyler, Our Man, from JSA. All right, two packs. Foil Ragdoll. He is like one of the staple cards in the set. Um, he's really powerful, but can be very dangerous if you're not careful. But let's just go over him re really quick. When Ahmed Samasar is put into a KO pile from play, you lose the game. But activate KO resource you control. If you do, search your deck for a location card, reveal it, and put it face down into your resource row and shuffle your deck. So really powerful effect, but he can lose you the game if you're not care careful. The Conclave is our rare. Very cool. Okay, and the last pack. Foil Ibis, is that how you pronounce it? Ibis, I-B-I-S, Ibis, whatever. And the rare is going to be the Rock of Eternity, a location card. Okay, that is it for the deck. Or not the deck. I've been doing deck profiles all night, so I forgot. It's for the deck, or for the box. Ah, can't talk. So I'm just going to go over the rares and foils again really quick. 
bring that stuck there. Oh, there's our our foil non foil Shazam. Captain Marvel, whatever you want to call him. Actually, what do they call him in, in this? Captain Marvel. Oh, okay. So yeah, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Uh, and also, let me know what you guys think of this uh, Infinite Crisis set. Do you guys think it was a good set? Or do you think it was one of those sets that, you know, should never have been printed? Or, yeah, just give me your thoughts about it. And that's about it. And thanks for watching.